Now people across the country are sending prayers and well wishes to Georgia Congressman John Lewis. Last night he announced he is battling stage four pancreatic cancer. Here's CBS 46's Rebecca Schramm. Driving along the downtown connector, the hero mural is hard to miss. It portrays civil rights icon John Lewis, who would go on to become a longtime congressman here in Georgia's 5th Congressional District. With the news of his illness, many here in the Auburn Avenue area are looking at this mural a little differently. We're praying for him and his family and wish them all well. For many, Congressman John Lewis is way more than a politician. He's a legend who gained national fame as a young man during the civil rights movement of the 1960s. We are tired of being beaten by policemen. We're tired of seeing our people locked up in jail over and over again. And then you holler, be patient. How long can we be patient? We do not want our freedom gradually, but we want to be free now. A couple of years later, during a march in Selma, he was beaten so badly by Alabama state troopers, they fractured his skull. Still, John Lewis continued his fight for equality and eventually was elected to Congress, taking office in 1987. It's a seat he's held for nearly 33 years. Now, Congressman Lewis is fighting something he never saw coming, stage four pancreatic cancer. Since his announcement, well wishes have been pouring in from the Obama the Clintons, and from politicians across the aisle. Remember this last month? Thank you, brother, for your service. The embrace between Lewis, the Democrat, and retiring Republican U.S. Senator Johnny Isaacson after Lewis's glowing speech about him. Isaacson sent this tweet, they don't make them stronger or braver, and I'm confident he will take on this challenge as he has every other he's faced with courage and determination fueled by his strong faith. In Atlanta, Rebecca Schramm, CBS 46 News. Rebecca, thank you. Here are more of those messages of support pouring in from both sides of the aisle. Former President Barack Obama said in part, quote, if there's one thing I love about Representative John Lewis, it's his incomparable will to fight. I know he's got a lot more of that left in him. And Republican Georgia Senator David Perdue tweeted, John Lewis is a warrior. If there's anyone who can beat this, it is him. Bonnie and I join the entire nation in praying for his strength in the days ahead. Let's go in depth now about pancreatic cancer. Here's a look at how common it is. According to the American Cancer Society, in the U.S. this year, nearly 57,000 people will be diagnosed with pancreatic cancer. Nearly 46,000 of them will not make it. They'll die from it. The American Cancer Society says pancreatic cancer is slightly more common in men than in women. It also says African Americans are more likely to develop pancreatic cancer than those who are white. Make sure you stay with CBS 46 as we continue to follow Democratic Congressman John Lewis's treatment and his fight to beat pancreatic cancer. We're covering this on the air and on the CBS 46 app.